I'd like to do a quick demonstration of the well model and show you how, how it operates and how a well operates under artificial lift conditions. What we have here is a model. Just like a real well, I have a gas supply coming into the well like you would have in your field from a compressor. I have fluid, I have formation, I have valves in the, in the production string at different depths. And I've got measurements, devices to show us what we're making from the well fluid-wise, how much gas we're making, how much gas we're injecting. So with our model, just as it, in your actual well, we will turn the gas on, we have the rig just moved off and we have a fluid level in the casing and tubing, and the well is in a static condition and not flowing on its own. So what we have to do is we have to start injecting gas and uncover the valves in the well and start injecting gas into the tubing string. As gas is injected into the casing, into the annulus, our fluid is depressed in the casing, it is being U-tubed through the open valves until we uncover them. Once we uncover the valve, we get gas in the tubing string, and now we have created a lighter uh, hydrostatic above the point of injection. We continue to do this until we reach the point of injection in the well, allowing a drawdown on the formation. If you notice our bottom hole pressure, we have begun to draw, draw this well down. At this point, we're still just U-tubing fluid from the casing, and we're probably not making any production from the formation itself. This is just annual fluid we're removing. But at some point in time when we, we get to a deeper point of injection, we will start drawing the well down and we will actually start drawing fluid out of the formation. We're about to uncover the second valve in the string. Again, now we have lightened the fluid from here up. And if you notice, our bottom hole pressure has dropped even more, allowing our well to start feeding in and we're currently making about 700 barrels a day. We're injecting 400 MCF a day. And these volumes, of course, are scaled. This is a scale model of a real well. We're continuing to unload, though. Even though this well is making 600, 700 barrels a day, we are continuing to unload, unload the fluid in the casing and tubing. And when we reach the bottom valve, we'll have our maximum drawdown on the well. So we are now uncovering the bottom valve. And as you will see in a minute, we have just started injecting valve at that point. Because of our gas lift designs, we have designed these upper valves to shut at a certain casing pressure, and they will not reopen. We want to get gas in as deep as possible, and we've got the maximum drawdown on our formation we can get. At this point, this well should be making about 1,000 barrels a day with an injection of 400 MCF a day something that would be very typical to the welds you see in, in your field.